happening tonight. We are likely just hours away from the start of a massive humanitarian mission to deliver food and medicine to the people of Venezuela. Opposition leader Juan Guaido leading the effort in defiance of embattled President Nicolas Maduro. And on the eve of that mission tonight, an incredible concert on the border between Venezuela and Colombia. Juan Guaido crossing into Colombia himself to attend the Venezuela Aid Live concert. Billionaire Richard Branson organized the show to raise more money for humanitarian aid. CBS 4's Amber Diaz is live tonight in Doral with more. Amber. And Rudeway, we've learned tonight that parts of the Colombia Venezuela border are closed, making it even more difficult for U.S. agencies to render aid to the country. But that's not stopping Venezuelans from keeping the faith. We're here in Doral, and people are celebrating tonight. They say they're not losing faith in their people, and they're not losing faith in Juan Guaido. A beaming Juan Guaido walked through thousands after crossing the Venezuelan border Friday. He showed up to a benefit concert held in Cucuta, Colombia, where world renowned Hispanic artists led by Sir Richard Branson brought the beats and some hope for a better tomorrow. Finally, finally, we are united. In similar fashion, churchgoers held a concert of their own in Doral, mirroring the theme of freedom and unity Friday night at Dios con nosotros. The goal to help raise $10 million for their native country. Many of their family members right now lack food and proper medication to sustain normal lives. My cousin, she grew up with me. You know, she had a tumor in her head and she had to go and she has to receive medicine and it has to be on a daily basis. If she doesn't get it, she'll die. For weeks, the U.S. Agency for International Development has been sending aid to neighboring countries. On Saturday, they'll take a chance and attempt to cross over into Venezuela, despite Nicolas Maduro's orders to have military block entrances. They're hoping to deliver almost 200 tons of relief. The position of the United States was really important because I think that they make pressure on the inside down um, in the Venezuelan government. I think, I think so that's going to happen. Now back out here live in Doral, we've also learned the military. They're the ones who helped Guaido cross the border, the same military that's backed Nicolas Maduro during his reign. Guaido says the Venezuelan people will help lead the way for aid tomorrow. In Doral, Amber Diaz, CBS 4 News, tonight.